We are heading over to the New Balance store, home of Warrior Hockey, to go meet Pittsburgh Penguin, Jake Gensel. Jake made his NHL debut on November 21st, 2016. The kid scored on his first shot and his first shift of the game. If that wasn't enough, the kid goes out on his second shift and he scores again. Two. Fast forward to the Stanley Cup playoffs later that season. Jake goes on to score 13 goals in eight assists. And then Gensel and the Penguins go on to beat the Nashville Predators in game six to win the cup. Man, don't some guys have all the luck. Come to think of it, when it comes to Jake Gensel, I don't think luck has anything to do with it. So your dad, Mike, was, uh, was a coach at U Minnesota for about 20 years. And I understand you were a stick boy as well. Yeah. And Phil Kessel was on that team. Yeah. What was that like for you? And how did that play into your experience here in the NHL? Yeah, I mean, I grew up in the rink. So um, just to be able to have that experience, be around uh, college players and, and my two brothers, I mean, um, I'm very thankful to, to, to have that in my lifetime and um, to be around Phil Kessel at that time. And uh, to be his teammate now, you look back at it and it's um, crazy how it happened. So when you fast forward to November 21st, 2016, I think you might know that day, yeah. which is your first NHL game. You scored on your first shift and first shot of the game. And I noticed that uh, Kessel was one of the guys on the yeah. ice at the time. I mean, what was that? Sounds like an idiotic question, but what yeah. was it like for you? Um, Phil gave me the puck on the weak side, and I just kind of, my parents told me before the game just to shoot pucks, you never know what could happen. And, um, Shot it on the ice and just happened to go five holes. So I uh, kind of blacked out after that, but um, it was just exciting to to have every my family there and um, to have Phil Gibbs this on that. Your parents were there, and your old brother was it Ryan? Ryan was Ryan. there as well. Yep. And uh, I remember the shot of your parents, obviously very excited, but your brother got emotional yeah. that as well. What was that like for you to see when you watched it back? Yeah. Well, I came back after the first period, and the guys that didn't play, they're like, "Wait till you see the video of your family and your brother." And um, I was just like, "Oh boy!" And then after the game, just to see how excited they were. I mean. Um, it's just a special moment for our family and uh, to see how proud they were and emotional was is, um, definitely meant a lot to me. But it didn't end there. So you come out on your second shift and you score again. I mean, unreal. Moment, yeah. Right. And tell me about that goal and then when you get back to the bench, what, what was going through your mind at that time? Yeah. Um, kind of like a three on two rush. Phil shot on the net. Gino tipped and I was just trying to go to the net. I mean, um, when you're playing with those guys, you just got to go to the net and um, rebound kind of kicked out to me. and. Just was fortunate to be on the, that end again. So all, all I could do is smile at that moment because you have two and two shots, and um, just a cool night. I was looking at some of the uh, some of the awards and, and accolades on Wikipedia, and there's one that stands out to me. What is Jake's Shake Milkshake yeah. <laughs> Milkshake Factory in 2019? Yeah, yeah so um, second year in the league, I, I lived downtown Pittsburgh, and there happened to be a milkshake factory next <laughs> next door. So um, made a lot of stops over there, and it kind of just happened that. Um, they asked to make a shake for me, and no way. Uh, it's one it's, you're most proud yeah, of, I bet, right? It's it's gone on, <laughs> and um, it's going pretty big in Pittsburgh, so it's really? been a pretty big, pretty big hit. I get the feeling you're not drinking too many shakes nah. <laughs> throughout the season, but that's yeah. okay. All right, I'm gonna go to let's go to some rapid fire questions. These are easy. Yeah. See how quickly you can answer some of these. All right. So, um, if you weren't a hockey player, what would you be doing? Golfer. Golfer. All right. What's your handicap? About four. What's your real handicap? <laughs> so hard. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Favorite city to play in other than Pittsburgh? Vegas. Vegas, really? Yeah. How come? Fan base? Fan base is uh, awesome. Good. It's pretty good at this rapid fire stuff so far. Childhood, ho childhood hockey hero? Sidney Crosby. Crosby, really? Yeah. You're just saying that because you're scared of Lila? He'll no. still feed you the puck. No, I think you're putting no. the puck in the net. You don't have to say Crosby. <laughs> uh, favorite movie? Focus. Well, I've never even heard of it, yeah. really. Yeah. Okay. Favorite playlist or song on Spotify right now? Ooh. Favorite playlist. Genre, maybe? Favorite genre? Yeah, I like rap. Rap, all right. Yeah. Free game? Yeah. All right. Post game win? Yeah. <laughs> right, good. Um, what shows are you watching right now? Suits. Great show. Yeah. All right, and last one. Favorite moment in your career so far, if you had to pick one? Probably the Stanley Cup. Of course. Best yeah. answer ever. Yeah. <laughs>